Hello Galaxy, I'm Chris Perillo and this is my view in fewer than two. Zoom is still something that people use and despite them now forcing their employees back to the office, which is just kind of weird because I thought like Zoom was there for, you know, enabling the work from home remote future. Zoom doesn't even believe in itself anymore. Apparently they believe in your data though, because if you use Zoom, specifically the generative AI features in Zoom, then it now, according to the new terms of service, has the right to take your data from your Zoom calls. Like you as a participant, whether you're using DMs, you know, you think you're you're doing things privately on Zoom or you're having a call and you're using the again generative AI features, Zoom is going to take that data and basically build their model around the data that you are creating for them in Zoom. You don't even need to have a, a Zoom account. It's it's your data. You are providing Zoom your data. You don't want that at all? Fine. Then you have to turn off all the uh, the generative AI features, which I'm going to guess most people won't because that's usually why people like using these teleconferencing products for all the bells and whistles, the neat things that you can do, even though every time you blur out the background, it looks like absolute trash. I've yet to see any platform that pulls that off well enough. Just get a green screen already, and certainly above anything else, get good lighting if you're going to be doing video. So uh, yeah, it's a big deal. A lot of people are upset uh, about this change because most people can't really worm their way out of a, a Zoom meeting because like, what are you gonna do? If someone like invites you to their Zoom call, say, no, I can't use Zoom, I don't wanna use Zoom, I don't to give them their data uh, or give them my data first of all you're giving other companies your data and you don't even realize it second of all you're not going to do that like you're not going to leap platforms because of zoom i'd be shocked maybe i'm wrong maybe you're going to tell me you're never going to use zoom again i'd again be surprised if that happened to be the case are you will you do you even care